Hey, what's up, guys? Hi, hey, YouTube. How's everybody doing today? Uh, happy um, Labor Day. It's Labor Day, right? Yep, yep. So I'm back, as you guys already know. It's a Dollar Tree haul. Like, I've just really been Dollar... Let me take these glasses off. So I've really been Dollar Tree haul. Oh, yeah, y'all. So these glasses, I had to use some um, uh, E6000 glue because... I broke them because I sat on them. I think I don't know if I told y'all that or not. And so, anyway, these are my glasses I wore around the house. And right now, I, I've been um, actually I've been uh, vlogging right uh, with you guys uh, or for you guys. Um, I've been cleaning, and today I got dressed to clean. So this is what I'm cleaning in. I wanted to like to be motivated to clean, so I was like, you know what? Let me get myself together. So let me show y'all what I got on. So this is what I have on today. First of all, I got on a shirt that says Elevate Your Thinking, Elevate Your Life. That's a church I go to. I go to a church called Elevate Life Church. And what in the... Somebody's been messing with my pretty picture. Oh, got all messed up. Anyway, so I got that on. I got on like some... These things are called like joggers. Like they're supposed to be um, like long, like where they go down to your ankle and whatnot like that. But I got them pulled up. So this is what I'm cleaning in today my cute little leopard joggers from H&M and then this shirt that was I just cut the the top of it off and I got on this little headband thing and this actually came from Dollar Tree I got it like a year and a half ago maybe two years I don't know but I'll link um the haul that I did when I got this thing because you can use it in multiple ways or whatever and you can see that in that video but anyway so let's get straight into this haul it's a it's a haul from two shopping trips instead of doing two different videos I was just like you know what let me just put it all together um because I'm going to be going to the Dollar Tree again because I'm on the lookout for some stuff that I seen some of you guys hauling and so I want to find it so let's get straight into the Dollar Tree haul um I picked up some stuff the one night after, oh no, this is the stuff I picked up on Saturday. Okay, I got this stuff Saturday. I got some, <laughs> I got some more decorative mesh, and y'all see that on my walkthrough video. I don't know if it's uploaded, well, it'll probably be uploaded before I upload this, so yeah, but I got this to make uh, a fall wreath for the door. I already made one for work. If y'all follow me on uh, Instagram or on Facebook, you've already seen it. It's really, really cute. And if I can, I'll try to insert a picture here. Um, but so, yeah, I got that. So, what did I end up with? I ended up with three, five rolls. I got three rolls of orange, a green, and a brown. I just have to improvise because I was looking for... I was going to do brown, orange yellow and red it's a real pretty red but they didn't have all this is all they had left and then they had two more orange left and so i'm just going to improvise so um my, the dominant color of my wreath is going to be orange and um one of my facebook friends asked me to do a tutorial so i'm gonna record it when i make it and so to go along with that i got some um some um pipe cleaners to use and got some orange ones to stay in the color scheme and for the wreath to make the wreath I got two of these I actually got another one and that came from a, another shopping trip but I got two metal wreaths from, you know of course they came from Dollar Tree and so they cost a dollar let me slow down I talk so fast sometimes my words get jumped up um but when I was in Michael's, I seen that these were at Michael's same exact size for two dollars and ninety eight cents. So th these, when you find these in the Dollar Tree, these are really a great deal. So pick those up. And uh, yeah, you know what? Yeah, go pick you up some. Get you some of this um, decorative mesh because we're gonna be making some wreaths up on this channel. I also picked up these. Um, kids little fashion nails for Viva because she likes to be like mommy and get her have her nails done so we're gonna be doing our nails together so I got some glue I'm not sure if I'm gonna put glue on her nails yet I'm not sure how I feel about that um, but I got the glue for me and then 
I also picked up some hangers and my the little um dang it. I had to get them because they were pink and they're all like this because the little um they broke out of the listen they broke out they broke out of their little packaging but um it was eight per pack and i got two packs and i had to get them because they were pink y'all know i love pink and so what i would like to do is um eventually have all the hangers in my closet pink i think that would be really nice so and they're a nice bright hot pink so i got those and then I also got that's Donovan's uh, back of that box. And I also got these cute little cookies. I'm so excited, guys! I can't wait. Look, isn't he adorable? This little jack o' lantern, and the coolest thing is, you turn it on and it lights up. Ooh. Yes, and y'all. <laughs> I don't know if I can tell y'all this or not because this is kind of embarrassing. But, um, yeah, have to excuse my background. I have my laptop card just hanging out right there. But, um, <laughs> this is kind of, for real, this is kind of embarrassing. Um, but I only bought one because I thought the other ones didn't work because I kept, when I was in the store, I kept turning them on, turning them on. And then it wouldn't light up. So I was like, dang, like, hardly any of these things work. Like, what's up? So I found one that worked. Well, then when I got home, I real it had like a little, um, even though it came on, it had a little, a little um, like a little tab right there. And that's when I realized, I was like, oh, I bet all those other ones didn't come up. Uh, come on because the tab hadn't been pulled and I guess my tab had just gotten like shook and loose and that's why it was coming on but anyways I think it's a really great find so I'm not sure if I'm going to decorate my bathroom with it or my classroom I actually think I'm going to go see if I can find some more and then I got this cute little pumpkin and it's um I don't know what is this material called like ceramic or something I don't know all I know is it's breakable and it's really cute so I bought that one and I got this cute little guy uh, he was cute so I picked that one up then I got another one I was like, look at Dollar Tree. They are really stepping up their game. I mean, Dollar Tree always on point if you ask me. But I really like that one too. So I've got my cute little pumpkins right there. And then that was it. I think that's everything I got from. Uh, no, 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 no. Actually, you guys, you know what? I thought I was doing it like separate, but I'm not. This is actually three different shopping trips combined together and I'm not gonna be able to tell you what I bought what day and whatever whatever day whatever this is all the stuff came from Dollar Tree I got me some pink decorative um mesh because I'm gonna make another wreath with this cute little pink butterfly on it because y'all know my favorite color is pink so I'm gonna make that for my door to hang on my door I think I'm gonna hang it on my bathroom door right there so that's what that's for and I will definitely share that with you guys when I do it then I got this for my um excuse me for one of my Scentsy um pots the light went out so I bought that for my Scentsy pot in my bathroom I'm not at 100% sure 100% sure I'm not 100% sure if it's the right size but I'll let you guys know if it works out I'll let you know I got some goodies, some books. Um, I got some books on these are the ones I got on. Oh, I got another book, guys. Hold on, let me go get my other book. I already started reading it, so it's not over here. Hold on. Okay, 
So I picked up some books on Saturday and I picked up some books yesterday, which was Sunday. So let me just show you all these cool books I got. And it's hard to pass them up when they're a dollar. And then I got these few items right here to show you too. And all right, we'll go here first. Okay. <sighs> These are really cute. These are some fashion binder clips. And they say happy. Can y'all see that? I don't know if there's a glare or not. But this one says happy. This one says love. This one says wow. This one says fun, best, and yeah. Those are really cute. Really, really cute. I like those a lot. Then we got some poster shapes. Super, super cute. It includes five shapes. And these are it. And it's probably four of each shape because there's 20 total. And I'm pretty sure that's what it, they did. Then I got me a coloring book because you guys know I like to do coloring, reading, or puzzles before I go to bed. And I'm really liking this one because it's floral and I love flowers and I like it because it, it doesn't have anything like you know you color one side and then there's nothing on that side you know if that makes any sense like some of the other ones had uh, two pictures on one piece of paper hopefully I'm making sense there so I got that one and then I also got this one the uh, geometric shapes and I like I really like this these new ones I'm really feeling it and it's pretty thick it is pretty thick and I guess it's because, you know, they didn't do the double pictures. You know, y'all know what I'm trying to say. And then I got this for Kingston. I got him a uh, sketch pad. He likes to uh, color and draw and stuff. And, you know, I'm just a firm believer that whatever your children show interest in, you try to, you know, support it and bring it out. You never, I mean, I, I don't know. You never know what they're going to be when they grow up. He may be an architect. He might be a uh a uh, 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 artist and a painter i mean you know you just really never know uh, um an illustrator so i'm just encourage encouraging him and what he finds passionate so that's why we got that and we already have crayons and pens and markers and all that stuff at home so now let's get into these books so i got a total of ooh, let's see one two three four five six seven books this one, I'm not going to lie, I was attracted to it because of the cover, and it's called The Bad Always Die Twice, and so I cannot wait to read that and see what it's all about, and if y'all want to know more about these books, you know, just let me know, leave me a comment, and I'll go into detail, like I'll read you guys the, um, the summary of what the book is about and then I don't know maybe we you know if you're reading the book or if you want to do like a book club maybe we should do a book club let me know if y'all want to do a book club maybe we can start a book club that would be real cool if we did that then I got this one taking care of business and um and uh down here Carl Weber says a great new taste in the literal in the literal world so it's probably good I don't know we're gonna see it says in this family there's no room for feuds so we shall see what that's about and then this one my mom picked up it's called the wow factor insider insider style secrets for everybody in every budget so hmm, i don't know my mom picked that one up so that one may be good oh and this cousin color look at that Ooh. okay yeah this is my mom's book. She picked this one up. She put this one in a basket. But I'll be sure to review it. Then I got Tony Braxton. I break my heart. I heard some good things about this book. So I was really interested in reading it. And I was real happy to see it for a dollar at the Dollar Tree. Because this book uh, retails for $27.99. And it's still in Barnes and Nobles and on the bookshelves. And I just couldn't bring myself to pay $30 for the book yet because, you know, I had some priorities and things I need to take care of. So I was excited to see it for a dollar, so I picked it up. Then I picked up Boyfriend Season, Cali Boys. 
and it sounds interesting so I mean I am I don't need to buy no more books I'm pretty much stocked up for the fall and winter months because that's what I like to do I love to curl up and read a nice book with a nice cup of coffee or tea anyways this one I like the cover of it it's called the mark and it says if you know today it says if you know today is someone's last should you tell them I don't know like if you know today is the last person's day on earth and you knew they were gonna die you didn't know how they were gonna die or it's like what time exactly but you knew it was gonna be today what you tell them sounds pretty interesting and then got this book by Carl Carl Weber the man and 3b and this looks like a Walmart uh, a Walmart sticker I'm not sure but anyways the list price is $24.99 and wherever it was at it, they were trying to sell it for $17.49 and I got it for all oh, honey yes <laughs> anyways guys that is everything for this haul and so it, it really wasn't that much stuff but it's just you know uh, three different shopping trips that I took to the Dollar Tree to pick up a few things and went in there for one or two things and picked up more because you know it's just how it is that's just like you just it's just how it is when you go to Dollar Tree unless you go in there with exactly like a dollar or exactly two dollars like you're gonna pick up more like usually because that's what I usually do but anyways guys thanks for watching and look this is another Dollar Tree find I got this from the Dollar Tree a little while ago but anyways, thank you guys so much for watching. And until next time, stay you, stay beautiful, and stay unique. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.